YouTube. Hello friends. Um, today we're going to do a very short um, exercise on how to create a GIF or a sh brief, a short animation to put at the end of your videos for a like or subscribe button. So we're going to, I'll be working in Photoshop and I won't see you again. You will hear my voice probably, but if you don't hear my voice in case my recording doesn't work, then you will hear a bit of music in the background. Follow along the tutorial. This will be in Photoshop and I'll be creating a thumbs up sign animated along with a um, subscribe button. All right. Have a good one. Okay. So to record our, to create our GIF, first I'm in Photoshop and what I'll do is um, I'll open new. And I always like to work with um, the film and video preset. That way I I have an idea of what size I'm creating and I always like to title it also. So I'll call this like button. And off we go. So I've already pre-downloaded um, uh, the image and all I have to do is get it. So I'm going to open my desktop and find the image. There we go. Open that. And next I'm going to drag it into, into my template. So drag that into there. That's pretty big. I've got to reduce the size. I always like to work with it slightly bigger than I intend to use it so that when I reduce it, it doesn't lose quality. So there we go that's about good enough and then the next thing I want to do is just um put some text over there uh, all caps like or subscribe okay. and then we're gonna reduce the size of our text about there. I think what I want to do. There we go. And then I want to center that. Select all our fonts, center it, and then drag it to position. I'm gonna move our thumb right there. Before I animate it, I want to give it some effects like um Let's give it a slight bevel. So I got my bevel emboss out. Check that. That's too much. So I want it to be just like that. And no drop drop shadow for this. I think this is good enough. Maybe change the gloss contour. Perfect. And I will copy those effects. Copy layer style. Paste it onto the font. Okay, yeah, that seems to work. And um, so I want to get rid of the background because I don't want, um, I want it to have no pixels there. Like I will save it as a, as a movie with no background. Great. Now that we're here, I will, I want to ch the thumbs up sign to change color when I'm um, um, in the animation. So what I'll do is I'll duplicate that by dragging it into there and then over that I will do a color overlay it should come out red awesome great and then what I'll do I think I'll change this no I'm okay with that alright so we're good then the next step I want to do is start animating it so first I'll change this to one second then I'll add a new layer turn off the red layer right add another one turn off this layer add another one turn on the red layer add another one turn off turn on that layer all right that's it and I'll leave it on forever in case I want to save it as a GIF but I'll save it as a movie then that's our an animation and that's what I'll put at the end of my video. So to save it, what I will do is I will export it as save for web. And 
and I will change my preset to GIF. Now, the issue I find with this, um, I haven't figured it out yet, but is that it comes out um, a bit low quality. So if you want it super high quality, you might uh, want to save as a movie, which I'll do shortly. So it looks fine um, at the moment. So we'll save that GIF and, and carry on to do save the movie. So for the movie, you go into file, then you export uh, render video. You could have also, I could have also cropped it to make it smaller, but since it's um, a transparent background, that doesn't really matter. And it's giving us our options, like button, MP4, great, fantastic stuff, saves to desktop, awesome. Great, that's about it. Um, that's how you do it, and I hope you found this useful. If um, you did find it useful, please leave me a thumbs up or subscribe to the channel. I always have various videos that I do um, on various topics and I would appreciate a thumbs up. So let's check out our animation. Now I'm going to open up desktop, my desktop and pull it. And if I open it up in Explorer, you can see how it's working. No, I don't want to. Okay, the antivirus also wants to be part of the game. Oh, goodness gracious. Sorry about that. So let's go back there, and that's that's the animation in um, um, that's the preview of it. Now let's check out the movie, like button movie. So there it is. Uh, we double click on it. Uh, 